By placing a mob head on a note block, you can recreate the mob's sound. And by hiding a few of them underground, your friends will have no idea where these sounds are coming from. Today, I'm fooling my friends in a hundred different ways. Starting with drip leaf to bedrock. Because if you stand on a drip leaf, it's absolutely fine. Chill. No worries, mate. All good. But if a second person follows you, they will fall to their untimely demise. And that person being Ethan, you just need to make sure that you have a nice little cubby cozy room for you to stand so you don't also fall to your untimely demise. So let's see what Ethan's up to. Ethan! Ethan! Oh, my ear, bro, shut up! What are you doing? Get back here, see bro! You later, bro. I'll blow you up like I blew up your face! Get back! What the fuck? What the fuck? No! no. <laughs> Yeah, good luck blowing up my base. You see, this all started when my friends blew up my base and made me an outcast. So now I'm getting revenge by pranking them until they leave the server forever. The name tag Johnny means that vindicators don't just kill players, but instead will murder someone's precious pet animals. And by someone, I mean chips. Look at him there with his lovely old sheep. He's having a grand old day. That day is about to end. Let's spot in some visitors, baby. Why do I have so many baby sheep? Oh my goodness. This breeding program's going a, a little too well. It whoa, why are there pillagers inside my sheep enclosure? Um, whoa, whoa, why are there three? Hey, hey, guys, no, no, stop attacking my sheep, please. Dude, look at this. What are you gonna do, Chip? What are you gonna, oh no. Oh, whoa, whoa, not me. They're coming for him. <laughs> And even with Chips passing, these Vindicators aren't stopping. They're continuing out this prank till the very end. Raining arrows. The trick with this is to make sure your arrows are jumping around like little dolphins, which means you have to charge your bow very lightly, just for a second, because if you charge too hard, it will go straight into the soul sand and won't be bouncing, ready to explode when I hit this button. That's right, this just ain't a dance party of arrows. This is a dance party of death. Get back here, you boy! You won't get away with this! What are you doing? Hey, Ethan, do you have a shield by any chance? What did you do to my base, bro? What is this? Wait, shield? Uh -oh. What do you mean, shield? <laughs> what the? <laughs> Skulk sensor explosion. The cheapest and yet most destructive prank that literally everyone and their grandmothers need to know. Just have a powered rail facing up like this and spam on as many TNT minecarts you want. The more, the bigger the explosion. Then you want to chuck down your stock sensor, but be very careful not to make a sound when you do, or it will be you who goes up in flames. Shh, Mookie is about to have a fun little surprise. <laughs> ah! <laughs> How? There wasn't anyone even near me. The infinite cobblestone generator. The secret is in the stairs, or well, using the stairs to control the water. Then you just need a repeating redstone signal by placing down an observer with one arrow facing towards the signal and then another arrow facing in the opposite direction. And boom, we got cobblestone for days. This is the perfect prank if you don't want to obliterate your friend, but still want to annoy yeah. them to the next level without, you know, ending your friendship. Uh, I finally am home. I can eat something other than a carrot. Uh what is that? People on this server are so messy. Why does someone put a cobblestone in my house? Okay, uh, what? Now you might be wondering why there's a repeating redstone signal and the piston isn't doing anything. That's because I've planted so it's exactly 13 blocks above the piston, which means that's exactly where I'll max out instead of, you know, driving all the way through his room. Why does this cobblestone keep reappearing? What is going on? Oh, someone's gonna pay for this. <laughs> Man's gonna be here for days. He's taking never back down, never what to a whole new level. Boat spam, which also uses our repeating observer clock. Except this time, it's connected to a dispenser with a hopper on top, a lovely little crafting table, and I can already see y'all in the comments being like, uh, Eli, that's not how redstone works. It's gonna do nothing. Well, that's because, ladies and gentlemen, I am the redstone. <laughs> Tricked you there. I'm actually part of this machine and you need to make sure your inventory is full and then you want to craft a ton of oak boats the trick to this is use the crafting book and hold shift as the oak boat comes out all right you ready guys it's coming any second now acacia oak bang and that will fill up this then you want to go ahead and hold q on this ready just absolutely spam these out and they're gonna start dropping the hopper then pull out again 
and keep spamming! Check it out. They are popping out like crazy. Except, oh man, it's, it's still going. This is going to take absolutely forever, bro. It's going so fast that I can't even see the animation on my screen. But that's okay. We can wait because I'm sitting in my super comfy brand new EY merch, y'all. If you are very impatient and want to enjoy life, then you've got to head down below or to eystream.store. We've got a ton of products that are only available for a limited time, so make sure you catch them before they sell out. Oi, Ethan, you know how to swim, mate? What? Yes, I've done swimming lessons. Get back here. Well, let's swim after this, boy. You're an idiot. You literally left a boat right next to it, bro. I'll just jump in this and... What the? What the? What the? What the? My river. Like Moses, I parted the sea. Now my house is gonna be worth nothing because there's no good view. Skull shriekers are the loudest sound in Minecraft and possibly it's terrifying because they actually cause a warden to spawn. Excluding one exception, if you place them manually in survival, then they just make the perfect prank without, you know, killing you to a warden. Just make sure to attach them to a single skulk sensor so that, that way your friends go absolutely mad. Oh, speaking of which, here comes Luke. Oh, what the sus is that sound, bro? Dude, that would be terrifying. He has no idea where it's coming from. Okay, it's stopped. We're all good. Everything's fine. Ah, oh, the voice is there back. Where is the coal? I swear I had it somewhere here. <laughs> oh, it looks like Chip is distracted. I think it's time for some enchanting. Well, you know, not just ordinary enchanting, but prank enchanting. Grab a cursed pumpkin. Well, carved pumpkin. It's about to become cursed with the curse of binding. This might seem like a useless enchantment, but let me tell you, every time your friend is AFK or distracted, this is so much fun to do. Just tuck a dispenser behind them, put down the cursor binding, put a button, and boop, on it goes straight to their head. I don't have enough items to even fill up this chest. That's so sad. This is really a bad reflection to me. I feel like my entire base has gone downhill after what happened with that freaking cobblestone. What is on my head? What? Jordan, what are you doing? What? What's on my head, Jordan? Hi, Chip. Come after me if you can. <laughs> Where did you go, dude? It's so hard to chase you right now. Oh my goodness! Hang on, wait. I can just. What? Why can't I take this thing off? It's bound. How did you get cursive binding on a pumpkin? Oh, Jordan! Explosive snowball. Now, this does require you to have a command block, but I mean, you're already pranking your friends, so cheating's not that bad, right? We're going to execute on ourselves. We'll go at, at E, which means all entities. Type equals snowball, because we want this to apply to, well, snowballs. And then we're going to say unless block and uh, tilde 0.1, tilde negative 0.1, tilde 0.1 air, because we don't want it to explode on air, we want to run summon TNT. Then just go ahead, chuck this on always active and repeat and you are Gucci to go. Hey, Ethan, you, you want to have a snowball uh, fight? No, not really. I've you destroyed my leg. You know what, fine. Haha, <laughs> can't hit me. Can't hit me. You're right. I have really bad aim. Oh, well. What the fuck? Oh, well. Oh, no, no I'm missing you, Ethan. Stop. No, please. Curse <laughs> <laughs> my river. Now my flipping face. Does this bot really think he can just go AFK on my server? <laughs> uh... Idiot. Pure idiot. Yep, he's not responding. Nah, dude, you're just asking to be pranked. This is too easy. You're literally a sitting duck. What we gotta do? Jump below him, put some obsidian, drop him down below, surround him with obsidian. Now, here's the thing. Obsidian, you can dig out of it. But you know what you can't dig out of? Infinite pistons. That's right. Because every time a piston, you know, shoves into your face, it will reset your digging animation. Meaning that, well, no matter how hard you try, even with the best pickaxes in the world, you still won't be able to break anything. <laughs> and then what you need to do, guys, once again, a repeating redstone clock using the observers. Oh, look at Luke. He's getting his head pounded in. Must be nice. I'm back. Okay, what's going on? Wait, I'm stuck. Help me. I can't break this block, someone please get me out of here, I'm pushed and moving! Everyone knows the good old pit trap, three blocks down from the door, oopsie daisies, you fell and died. Let's make sure they actually die. <laughs> With a little bit of minecart cramming, just get a dispenser into a rail like so, make sure you're covering up all four sides. Now, this can take a really long time, unless you once again use our lovely observer clock into the block here, and then we need to have a hopper going into the side of that dispenser, and go ahead and chuck a chest 
full of minecarts right there. You basically want to do this until it stops working, which means no more entities can fit into this space. Oh, Chip! Someone's knocking at your door. Who's at my door? <gasps> EY. Why don't you come answer it? Oh, hi, it's me. You know, your favorite guy. <laughs> oh, you better get back here, Brandy. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. What is this? Dude, dude, why am I in a hole full of minecarts? Why are they killing me? Hey! I'm beginning to feel very bad deep down in my heart for pranking Ethan. I really feel like he's quite upset that we keep ruining his house. You know, first the river, then his base. It's just all so sad. So I figured, you know what? Let's celebrate. Let's get into the Christmas loving spirit. After all, it is coming up very, very soon. And, uh, you know, make his house a little bit of a winter wonderland. We'll chuck our snow golems onto a lead like so. And then, uh, yeah, we'll just bring them all across here. Get some snow on here. Oh, his garden. Very nice. I'm sure he would love to have snow all throughout his garden. Ooh, that's a bit rough. They're, they're literally destroying the plants. Um, if I don't move, I can't get pranked. Ew, I cannot touch me if I sit on my epic two-step boat. I don't, I don't know why I did this, man. Wait, something doesn't feel right. There is something in the air. Oh, it's a winter wonderland. Oh, lovely. Look at that, guys. All over. Beautiful. Okay, we, we lost a couple of stragglers on the way. We gotta be. You can't go too quickly with this, alright? You gotta be patient, alright? I, I mean, it's still a lot faster than actual snow, which takes forever to come down. EY, he's outside. He's outside. Wait, 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 wait. No, no, no. We have to search the perimeter. There could be a trap anywhere. Okay, hold up. Walk slowly. Hey -ya! Here. No? Oh, Ethan's there! Quick, disappear in the water! <laughs> okay, good. The great thing about water, guys, is it instantly kills snow golems. Oh my gosh, there's still one. Nothing under my stairs? What the? It's what the snot? What? What the snow golems? What happened to my beautiful garden? It was meant to be a summertime wonderland, and now it's a winter destruction land! Christmas is not even snowing in Australia! This is geographically inaccurate! Stupid EY, I will get my revenge! I am so sorry, Chip, for being such an awful friend. Please forgive me like Jesus Christ has forgiven our sins. And you know what to make it up to? Oh, here's some diamonds. Oh, sorry, I misclicked. Wait, hey, I have to get these now. I was gonna forgive you as well. Oh, well, that's good. I just, um, do you like my frost walker boots, by the way? Uh, yeah, it's a really good enchantment. I, um, I just, uh, if, if you could sort of give me the diamonds as well as some Wait, oxygen, Wait, I, I don't know how to take off good. my boots. I, I can't take them off. No, no, oh, just, just, oh, no. Dude, I'm, I'm drowning. I'm drowning, EY. If, if you could sort uh, of I'm leave trying. me some space. I'm, I'm really trying. What are you doing? Hey, I'm about to drown, dude. Oh, uh, uh. Bro, you oh. gullibullers flip, dude! You think I was... Wait, wait, you took my diamonds. Did you know you can actually stack dripstones? That's right! Normally they kind of suck because if you drop them on your head, they only do about half part of damage. But if you drop a hundred, oh, they are an instant kill that is inescapable. Which is exactly why we have to put them above a portal just like this. Now, what we're going to do is to make this really quick and easy for us, we're going to copy down our two sides here, just like that. And a slash slash copy. And then you want to break the top half like this so that all of the lovely drips fall straight into the portal. Now, while they might seem like they've disappeared, I can guarantee you they have not. The minute someone pops up on the other side, they're all going to spawn straight back in. Yes, I knew it. I saw his name tag. Here he comes. <laughs> Hi, Ethan. How did you find me here? I totally didn't leave a bunch of clues for you to follow. Okay, he must have gone to the end. There's no escape, EY, buddy boy. It's time for your death. What the? What the? How was I skewed in the flipping end? The disguised creeper is a more refined prank for a refined civilization. Just search up a resource pack, you know, for this. Polymorphic creepers is a great one. It makes every single mob, well, a creeper. Oh, I've ran out of wheat. Oh, I guess I have to go back to my base and get some more of them. He's left his farm. This is actually perfect. All right, quick, quick, quick. Grab that. Oh, wait, no, we don't need an actual cow. We need, well, a creeper. And chuck that down. Look at that. You can't tell what the hell, dude. Okay, I'm back. Now, time to feed these cows. You hungry, guys? Wait, what's on? Why are they up? No. What? Since my kid cows blow up, this makes no sense. It seems that Chip is out of house. He's nowhere to be seen. Probably gone back to go get his loot because he just died randomly. I don't know who had anything to do with that. So you know what? Why don't we make some upgrades to his house? I think it needs a brand new roof. And of course, you can't make upgrades without scaffolding. I mean, Bob the Builder, he needs to place some stuff around here. And you know, see, the greatest part about scaffolding is it's really easy to break. You just break the block at the bottom and it all comes falling down. So when Chip comes back and sees this, he's going to be like, oh yeah, I'll just break this and it'll be absolutely Gucci to go. 
except waiting for her on top will be a nice couple of Advils. I am never trusting EY or his silly little fake diamonds again. Why is there scaffolding inside my house? Who has put scaffolding inside my house? Wait, I can't even see the top. Okay, I'm just getting rid of this right now. I don't want, I don't want any scaffolding around here. My house is not under construction. And here they come! This was a surprisingly good event. I can just quickly fill these holes and it'll be all good. What? Boom! Ooh, that has got to hurt! An anvil? Sweet! Oh, EY! Ethan's awesome roller coaster. I'm sure it's great, Ethan. In fact, it's gonna be better once I turn it into a roller coaster of death. Just pick some random rails, dig down, and put some lava. You might be thinking, well, that's so easy to avoid. Just get out of the minecart. Except Ethan's not gonna know the lava is there because if we put some item frames on top of signs just like this, we can use a map that looks just like a rail and... Okay, well, that that's a little bit sus. Let's rotate it and... Yeah, Ethan... <laughs> it's not worth it anymore. I'm not hunting that Bozo down. Every time I do, I just die. And my house gets ruined. You know what? Stop it. I'm riding my roller coaster to victory. Come here, Mr. Minecart. I'm about to ride this full and just go AFK. Honestly, like, I don't even care anymore. It's time to ride my roller coaster. Da -da -da -da. Ah, the only joy I have in life now. What the? What the? Why? Oh, where did he go? God, I just lost Ethan. Huh. That's so strange. I wonder where he went. Why am I only keeping God? Item frame hey, why? Uh, I think they teamed up and they're really mad. Okay, we, we need one last prank to make sure they never come after me again. Get that bot. He ruined my life. He gave me a crippling fear of scaffolding. Yeah, I'm tired of his stupid prank. Quick, grab the command block. We're going to do execute uh, at, at E. All of our arrows that we shoot out, and we're going to summon in the lightning bolt. Always active and repeat. I'm tired of these games. Mm, all of them, dude. We got to get this full. Oh, hi, guys. Uh, let me just uh, shoot you with an arrow. Boom, boom. Whoa, 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 here's a bow. Here's a bow. <laughs> Come, let us bring the arrow. Dude, no, 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 I'm getting out of here, I'm sorry. You guys wanted to come and stage a coup? No, this server belongs to me, baby. You just left, you just left, you can't handle it, you it. See you later, boys. Oh, Ethan, what are you doing, what are you doing? Guys, come back, guys, come back, don't leave me. No, I'm leaving, I'm out. I love it here, guys. You know what? Since I have no more people to prank, uh, could you guys join the server? The IP's at the top, I, I need some people to prank. Okay, you know what? You're my fans. I won't prank you. But if you want to see me prank Ethan and Luke, join right now. Works on Bedrock and Java Edition. Play.eyserver.com. Thank you to all of these guys for making today's video possible. You're my new favorite EY mega fans. If you want a shout out, just click the join button below this video. Scroll down and click EY mega fan.